Hello, my name is Michelle Gibson, and I am a native of New Orleans, artist, choreographer. I received my Master's of Fine Arts degree from um, the American Dance Festival at Duke University in 2010. And my thesis was called Taking It to the Roots. And it was about New Orleans culture focusing on second line movement. Second line dance to a New Orleanian is not anything you learn in a studio. It's something you learn growing up. It's part of the community. I felt like I wanted to define myself within my own culture as a dancer. And so that's where this idea of second line aesthetic came from. And I'm creating a vocabulary for it. It's a lot of footwork. I'm creating a language for it. So, so the academic areas can have an appreciation and vocabulary for it. And then the people, the general people in the community can have another type of appreciation for it. One of the movements that I do, that we do, is called buck jumping. So bucking came from that, and so I was like, workshop, <laughs> buckshot. So this whole buckshot experience is not just about the dance, because inside of the dance, there are other components that support the bigger vision of that. The kicking brass band played, um, came in and did a lecture demonstration on the brass music of second line movement. Then I had the Tighten Up Brass Band who came in and played for my actual class. I had uh, Shaka Zulu who is the big chief of Yellow Pocahontas. What I want for people to do is to recognize culture. It's placement and positioning who you are. Yeah, I think like even even each culture and region has its own like uh, individual uh, take on stuff because you know like Mexicans and Aztecs and stuff like the, the man in the feather suit and stuff dressed like an eagle and here you know he's dressed like a stilts and like this 70 pound crown full of like peacocks and, and turkey feathers and just everybody in every region even so close and so far just like it's similar in so many ways but everybody's got their own take which is really interesting to hear like that many differences. This was about people just recognizing a particular culture but also being able to go home and acknowledge their own culture. This is who I am. Be proud of who you are. You know what I'm saying? And so we are so rich in who we are back home I just wanted to bring the richness to other people to, yes, see who we are, but acknowledge who they are too.